In my last video, uh, I put this bike together. Uh, it is obviously a Carbon X. It's a Walmart bike. But I wanted to go one step further. I wanted to actually turn it into uh, an e-bike. So what I did is I bought a thousand watt um, motor and a 52 volt battery. Um, you know, so that I could uh, put something together decent. The battery actually I already had from another bike. And the principle behind it is that the company that produces this actually produces an electric bike. And I'll throw that on the screen here real quick. So granted theirs is only a fraction of the power that this one's putting down, but hopefully it doesn't explode when I put it together and uh, start to get it uh, going. So. I'm going to do a quick time lapse and the time lapse is going to be me converting this bike over to an electric so here we go It looks like we finally got this thing pretty much well buttoned up. Uh, had a screw that disappeared, actually landed in my shirt, and I spent almost a half hour looking for it, but found it. That was for the display. Uh, also, didn't get the pedal sensor all the way done because the um, pedal sensor bracket isn't exactly uh, connected the right way. So, other than that, uh, I have to do the brakes as far as brake sensors for the motor. I didn't want to do anything with it currently because I don't want to get rid of the stock piece. Uh, so that's going to be in a second video. There's going to be some button up stuff, but uh, let's go ahead and uh, see how she works or if she works. Okay, that was a five. I'm going to put it on one and see what it does. Okay. Well, it looks like it is uh, operational, so um, I'm going to finish up the... Uh, I'm gonna finish up the next couple of things on it um, and then, you know, essentially get everything done once I've got uh, the brake sensors done and see if I can do something with the pedal sensor uh, since I took the crank off and at least put the magnetic piece in there. 
Um, I'm going to uh, do a follow-up video and show you what the bike looks like uh, outdoors and then maybe a little bit of a ride. So uh, any questions, please leave them uh, down below. Comments are also welcome. You know, granted, I'm not a professional by any stretch of the imagination. I've only put a few bikes together. So this is just kind of a fun little project and something that I've been wanting to do for a little while. And we're going to see if this Carbon X frame holds up to the torque of a thousand watts and 52 volts. So um, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video here real soon.